another episode of the Legacy Gambit. Today we are continuing our escapade through the A to Z of Legacy and have reached the letter H. And we decided today to bring a modern deck into Legacy in the form of Mono White Hammer. If of course you are watching this video, feel free to like, share and subscribe. Share with us through the algorithmic gods. And of course uh, everything in the video today and all the, the descriptions and any further information will be in the uh, details below and of course we'll be on Moxfield so feel free to share and follow us there as course. but of course it is not me on the legacy gambit I am of course joined by my lovely co-host Sarah Sarah are you ready to make a large large friend and you know I I am I'm really looking forward to this one yeah. Hammer is one of those decks I've always enjoyed in modern mm -hmm. it hasn't been as good recently I mean that's but fair. bringing it Bring it up to Legacy, you get a lot of fun upgrades in cards that I've always loved in Mox Opal oh. and the Artifact Lands. Oh, I love this. So yeah, folks, we are playing today um, Mono White Hammer Time. This deck has, uh, I felt a lot of modern players who wanted to test Legacy have tried to play Mono White Hammer Time. Um, it's very similar to the Modern Shell, but yes, we do get some cool upgrades in the Artifact Lands, Mox Opal, Rest in Peace and Modern. Uh, but also we get Mother of Runes, we get, um, uh, what else do we get actually? I think, is it just Mother of Runes, Mox Opal and the Artifact? Oh, and Caracas, we get Caracas, Caracas. Caracas. And Swords to Power Chest. Oh, <laughs> that's oh, a pretty big one. That's, this is, um, ooh, mwah, this is kind of where it is. But yeah, the deck is very much, you play some small threats. Um, so you have things like Esper Sentinel, uh, Mother of Runes, Ornithopter, uh, you have Sagada's Aid. And then you have this hammer, which would cost eight to cast, but because of Sagada's aid, you can just attach it to a creature you control. And uh, you can play it flash speed. So you just play it, and then end step, you can play one mana, attach it to an Orofopter. The Orofopter is now humongous. Uh, and you can attack, and it's very, very fun. Um, you also have, because this is a um, kind of equipment deck as well, we have as a saga to find all the various things we're missing so in hammer foundry shadow spear uh mox opal things like that and then of course uh because it is an equipment deck we have stoneforge mystic uh pure steel paladin to kind of you know let, you know draw a card or find our equipment uh in terms of other stuff as well because this is kind of an equipment like you know something we have things like nettle cyst uh to make a little friend so if we have a bunch of things but we can't necessarily equip them or whatever we can still make this rather large this is a you know this is very much a Legacy and Vintage staple. Sword of Fire and Ice, which I think, as much as I I understand why it's here, I think this is probably the sword I would probably uh, perhaps cut. Uh, but it still does work against Delver and against some of the decks of the format. Um, you know, against like red decks or even sort of blue decks, it still does work. And Forgeny, which is from the Lord of the Rings set, which is basically um, you can equip um, abilities as an instance, similar to kind of like Sagada's Aid in that respect, but you can also reanimate an equipment so if it's died to remove all the things like that um and i think you can also mm. equip zero so sim if this this card kind of does pure steel paladin um uh sagada's mm. aid and a sort of reanimation spell for that so um i think that is also super duper fun so i am excited to play this the only other thing is our sideboard oh, sarah sarah i'm ready to manitize people so hard oh <laughs> let's go i'm ready i'm so ready uh, so we have Manitive, uh, Deafening Silence against Combo, March of Worldly Light to kind of deal with kind of pesky permanence. Uh, probably this is more for, uh, you know, things like Urza Saga and uh, pesky permanence that we have to do with Leyline Avoid. We can't, you have to address the elephant in the room that graveyard decks are very popular at the moment. Same with Tormod Script. And then Cauldra Complete, because sometimes we just need to kill our opponent in like three turns. And, uh, you know, Stoneforge into Cauldra is still very powerful in 2024. And I think that's basically it. There's a few copies of Silent Clearing, which I think are an interesting mm -hmm. addition. Mm -hmm. It makes sense. Yeah. Uh, the deck mm -hmm. you're kind of chaining through, you want to get kind of exact mix of mm -hmm. these synergy pieces a lot of the time. Uh, the kind of weird thing coming into Legacy from Modern mm -hmm. is that a big thing that this deck does in Modern when it's good is that it prevents your opponent from tapping out because they fear the hammer. Yeah. Um, and then you kind of just delver them with, like, Urza Saga and Efficient Threats. Yeah. And if they ever try and deal with those, then you hammer them. Um, that is less true in Legacy. Yeah. 
uh, because free spells are more common in Legacy. Correct. You have days, you have Force of Will. That said, though, I'm pretty sure we're going to be forcing a lot of early days yeah, and yeah. early Force of Wills, yeah, yeah. Uh, which hopefully sets our opponent back and lets us as Saga start to take over the game. Also, Wasteland exists, yep. so you have to be more careful with Urza's Saga in this yeah. version than in the modern version, where it's only really the green decks that make <laughs> you think too hard about it. Um, but yeah, it should be good. It should be fun. Yeah. Um, this strategy always looks really simple on its face, but actually ah. is often very complicated yeah. to actually play. Um, I haven't played Hammer in a while, so I'm ready to make a fool out of myself. Uh, it's going to be great. Folks, let us get into round one and see how we do. All right, folks, we are here for round number one. Sarah won the die roll. You know how we feel about winning die roll. We love it. And you know what? Okay, let's think. This is fine. Like, you just go, like, turn one mum. We or, don't like, have double white yet. We can find double white. Which is an issue. We'll find double white. Uh, yeah, I'm just playing it through in my head. Sorry. This is the thing you have to do with Hammer. You can't just, like, keep on heuristics. You actually have to, like, run through everything in your head. Um... So in my head, I'm just going over, like, turn one mum or turn one Urza Saga go. But I'm you can't me. lead on Urza Saga. Well, we good. don't have Ancient Tombs, so oh, yeah, it's not... Sadness. I think um, we just keep, like, turn one mum, go, and then, like, see what we draw. Yeah, people think we're deaf and taxes. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay. Sure. Let's see. Like, I think turn one mum is like, because if it also eats a, even if it eats a removal spell, that's fine. That means our stuff doesn't. Eat. It is interesting that this is a mono white deck, and I think it has like four planes, which I find very funny. Uh, but we have ancient Dan and Caracas, so it's not like it's. You also have like Mox Opal. Yeah. Um, turn one mum. This is the fairest magic we've played in a long while. All right, so that resolves. Very nice. Oh. I'm surprised we're not playing mum and stepmum. Uh, it's just because obviously stepmum is uh, played in the modern version. Um, this protection from colourless is, is sometimes relevant in Legacy. It's not as relevant as it is in modern. It does make the hammer fall off. Yes. Which okay. is kind of a big problem a lot of the time. At least with... Oh, oh, with, oh Sarah. Ah. <laughs> oh. Oh, well, at least at least we're going to have a... We're going to have a quick, quick round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we have Deafening Silence, so we've got, we've got to... I mean, this is kind of what we don't want. You know, this is what... You... Oh, hold on. Bar Ritual, okay. This is Oops, right? Yeah, we're playing... We're being... Oh, God, yeah, this yeah, is Oops. Yeah, fine. All right, well... There it is. Well, we can source of plowshares this, unless they have a mana. Do you have a mana? Are you passing? If you're passing, this is... No, okay, we are just... Yeah, no, let them let them do it. Okay. Welcome to Legacy, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was quick. All right, let's. Uh, I I always like seeing what their deck is. Okay, Sarah, let's have a quick. I mean, it's just very oops. Okay, I mean, this is just kind of uh, memories. Okay, so there are memories journey, Sarah. Uh, mm -hmm. FYI, they're playing the good version. They are playing the good yeah. version. Yes. Okay. So we've got fast oracle. Okay. So that's fine. All right. Cool. Pact of negation, Sarah. Just be mindful. They've got pact of negation. Answer. Cool. All right. So they're going to be like Xanted swarm or something, maybe against us, or um. So okay. So, okay. So definitely. So... so let me let me just kind of go with gut feeling. Work backwards. I think it's like D seven, right? Mm hmm. Cut this sword. Marches might be useful. You can essentially cut all of the kind of... Dirtly stuff? Dirtly stuff. So you can cut Nalsus for you know. But cut off free drops, basically. Yeah. Doesn't necessarily. You can cut Retrofit of Foundry Shadow Spear. Lion Sash, actually, if it does get... If we do have... If we do get to Lion Sash... It's way too slow. It is, but... Um, I, mean, I think you have to cut it. Um... Da, 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 da. What else? What else? What else? Let's look. So we've got three more. We need surges. Like... Surges is. Uh, I think mom is worse than surge. I think mom is worse than. Uh... Surge can protect deafening silence. Mom can't. Permanent skip. I don't know what surge is doing. It protects your deafening silence. 
from remove from like force of vigor. Yeah. Ah, oh, I understand now. Thank you, sir. It took it, it took half a second, but I got you. Um, and then are we cutting like a sword? Are we kind of like swords. Yeah, I think so. Like it's not really what we're doing. Yeah, like they if they're gonna go, they're gonna go. I think this is this is our game plan. Okay, so basically our plan is to stop them, and then we can just win with a ham sandwich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You don't need much to win. <laughs> uh, you just need to stop them from winning. Uh, not with this hand. This hand is... The biggest issue is going to be clocking them quick enough that the char belt your side plan doesn't happen. Okay. Uh, we can't do this. This hand's... Nope. Doesn't do anything. Either does that. Uh, yeah, there's no hate piece. For a second I thought there was a deafening silence in it. I was like, that's a keep, but it's not. Oh, there's, there's ley line. Uh, yeah, you keep this. Uh, you put back sorts of plowshares... And pure we'll steel, steel, I think. Uh, yeah, I think. Yeah. We'll just find. We can just find some. Oh, we're effectively on the multi four, but I think opponent is also mulling. So. What are they looking? I mean, obviously, the thing with oops, you just need one of those hands that like, can actually. I think they, they probably want interaction more than like going fast. Mm -hmm. Or they need a char belt your hand. Yeah, exactly. Like, that's where. Ley line is not always good, but we have to respect that. I mean, oh, that's silent clearing. Yeah, yeah, I will. Sorry, I thought I've. <laughs> okay. That was on me. I was... It's okay. Uh, you just go silent clearing, cigar as I don't want to Just dump your hand. Uh, <clears throat> silent clearing, ornithopter, the guard is aid, mm -hmm. and then we're basically just saying. Yeah, we will find. Maybe going as a saga first was better, actually, I just mean... because it finds the hammer. But it's yeah. it's fine. If we draw any equipment. We're off to the races. Or a stone forge master. Or a stone. Oh, whoop! They're looking at us, going, "What is this?" <laughs> They're like, "What?" It's a card, is it? I wish this card was good in Legacy. I really do. But I think that, like, I'm. I think it's just not too slow, but I think it's mm -hmm. you're kind of playing this piece and going go. Um, oh, no land, no mana. What have you kept? Probably, probably a hand that's like one piece off, and they don't want to expose it to wasteland. That's fair. <laughs> yeah, it's that makes sense. Kind of common. Oh, my God. Okay. All right. Founder. Um, um, yep. As a saga. Stone Forge. Go get the hammer. Go get hammer. Can't cast a chip. Nope. Okay. Don't need to. Don't need to. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> Our thing's got flash, it's fine. I'd like to get a large hammer, please. Thank you! <laughs> uh, and then we'll find Attack for zero. <laughs> oh, why not? Send a message. <laughs> They have to respect our gumption. I mean, just take it. <laughs> I love doing that. I'm just like attack. Exit. Yeah, I'm a good fan of doing. I'm a yeah. good fan of doing that. Yeah. Okay. Just building your hand back up. Sometimes I've seen Oops players do that. They just kind of like go, okay, okay. Oh, are we dead? Not dead. Might be dead. If we're dead, we're dead. 17. Our patrol. Ball therapy. Alright, we're gonna take, take our hammer. That's fine. Okay. I mean, that's kind of the. I wonder what they're naming, Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if this they... is where they name you are already dead. <laughs> <laughs> and <then> just go <laughs> No, they took hammer. Okay. So I took hammer. That's fair. Like, I, w I wonder if they're just kind of slowing us down. Okay. Well, let's see what we're drawing. Wasteland. It's a good draw. Yeah, we just snap off the wasteland on them. Yeah, yeah. Then we just pack for one. Mhm. Mm 
See, this is the point where maybe playing as a saga first would have been better, because we would have been getting a hammer this turn. That's fair. Yeah. Oh, just, okay. 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 Uh, we're on the draw, though, now, Sarah. Uh, do we do anything on the draw? I think we just keep it as it is on the You bring in mana, Tate. Oh. <laughs> no, uh, it doesn't do anything on the draw. No, no, I'm we're... kind of just like... <laughs> just like, yeah. yeah. Um, well, I mean, is it? I mean, it's pretty spicy. Uh, if we can... Like, I don't mind bringing one in. Just as like a... Mm. Okay, I've I've got a wild suggestion. Okay, done. Talk to me. Cut the swords of plowshares. Alright, I'm cutting I'm cutting the swords of plowshares. Out. Cut an ornithopter. Cut one I'm cutting the one that's not white boarded, because obviously. Bring in two mana type. Yes, let's go. My my reason being <laughs> more than anything is it ups white count for March of other Yeah, no, I, that makes sense. I get that. I understand it. So if they have a char belcher, go hand. We might be able to just march the Char Belcher. Because like, sometimes they have to like deploy Char Belcher and pass. Oh my god, Sarah. Yeah. Y yep. We snap keep this. We snap it off. We're literally like snapping this hand off. Oh, we're gonna win any hand, it's gonna be this one. We'll keep this. Yep. We'd like to put this ley line of the boy then place. Thank you. Alright. No turn one trial belt your hand, please. And okay. no, nothing? Oh, Sarah, let's go. Again, like, they know we're a wasteland at. They shouldn't deploy their lands if they're not going to do the thing. So, okay. basic planes? Basic planes, ornithopter, crypt, silence, in that order. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, that's not uh, good. Wait, do they play mind break trap? No, they don't tend to. Uh, yeah, crypt, definitely. Do they not? Tell. No, they don't, because they're, 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 it's... Yeah, they're, they're normally a force of vigor deck if they're going to do anything. Oh, now I'm worried. They might pack to negate. Mm -hmm. Then if they do, then... Okay, that's resolved. So I think next turn we're going... I mean, we... we really need to draw an equipper. That's like the big problem now. Oh. Like, we've slowed them down, but we're actually kind of not in the best spot. If we mean... just top like a cigar designer, we're in a great yeah, spot. Yeah. I mean, even if like even if we go like Stoneforge into Hammer, like you know we're getting to that point. Mhm. Mm but I mean, this is where oh, there it is. Yep. Force pitch force. Okay. Okay. They still have to deal with this deafening stuff. That's March. That's helpful. That is um, da, 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 da. clearing Stoneforge. Yeah, the problem is, what do you grab off Stoneforge? Um, the only thing we've got is hammers. I don't think. Yeah, it's it's annoying because it promotes Cabal therapy. We um, could just go land go. I don't think that's going to win us the game. Is the issue? Um. Da, 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 da. Is there any reason that we'd want to hold up much? Uh, Probably not. I mean, the... if they go for... Hold on. One, two, it, if we go Landstone Forge, they go Cabal Therapy. That's an entire turn because of Deafening Silence. So it's probably fine because of that. Um. So yeah, so go Silent Clearing, Stone Forge. The Cabal Therapy, the Cabal. Makes me slightly wish we had Caldra in the last. Maybe no, there's no real room for it. Yeah, the problem. Yeah, the problem is, is that you die. You know, I'm not with the yeah, fact yeah, that yeah. we've 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 passed the. You know, the 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 joke is we've passed the midpoint of the game. <laughs> yeah, there just might be an argument actually that like Caldra because it's a fret all by itself. Yeah, it just in these of... games where you want to mulligan down real low for key pieces. Yeah, I mean that it could be worth. Having. Yeah, true. It's just hard to realize that until you're actually playing, and I need to test to be sure. Yeah, this is why. But this is why we do what we do. do, do, do. 
the thing is they pitch they force pitch force so like the the force of figures like they're probably gonna have like three maybe four uh-huh so I'm kind of slightly surprised they're not deploying artifact mana, like a piece at a time. Yeah, just like, here's a Lotus Petal Girl. Yeah. I mean, we'd march them yeah, on the yeah, spot. Obviously. But like... um, okay, uh, just swing for one, I think, and then I think it's just pass. Yeah, yeah. Now, we've got mar- now we've got march for three. Do you want to pitch this Stoneforge? Mm-hmm. Do you want to put uh, mm, no. Which, funnily enough, is under say Informer. Just yeah, yeah. Enough. yeah. I was thinking about playing the hammers, but there's no. Um, there kind of is actually. Uh, they probably can't go off this turn. Um, so you probably actually deploy one hammer here. What and just have march for. I don't think they can go off this turn. Okay, so that's the, my point. So I think one. it's like deploy one hammer. Yeah. Don't deploy the other one yeah, in no, case their equipper is cigar to side. Yeah, yeah. But if our equipper is pure steel paladin, you already want them on the board. Okay. Well then we just pass. So yeah. We have played our one non creature spell this turn, so this is like the the recall I have to have mm-hmm. when I play these kind of spells. We've played our one non creature spell. Consider that we've played our one non creature spell. Dude. Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, Pwn? I mean, if your hand's just like, send me a spirit guide, send me a spirit guide. Like that's another way that we get around this. Whole schmoz. Mm. <laughs> the difficulty is inability to, like, dread return on the same turn yeah, most yeah. of the time. This is the... Are they, are they going for a... They're going to start dumping their hand? What have you kept? You kept seven, Habibi. Maybe they've drawn the Farrakhan. We've been there. I've been there. You've been there. Yeah, but then sometimes you just want to discard. Okay. They're so playing a land. I don't land. Oh. I don't want to go to seven. There's a cigar. Okay. So. Play cigar as aid. Yep. You hit him for turn and say kill me next turn. Bet you can't. Oh, we've played our one spell. We have to do it next turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Do I attack the <clears> one? <throat> mm-hmm. Yeah. Stoneforge. Stoneforge beats! Sarah, we're, we're masquerading as death and text. Resolve the guard is aid. You're on 18. I think it. End step will put a hammer on her. You're doing an ornithopter, right? Yeah, most likely. They've got force of vigor to hear that we've back breaking. Oh. I did I win? Okay, we are probably dead, but we'll see what happens. Wait, what do they pitch? Land? Oh. Mm-hmm. If we're dead, we're dead. Like, a deck like this does not face a deck like this. <laughs> it's just like. Marks. Uh, let it let it come in. Yeah. Now we march up. Trigger back, please. Yeah. Oh wait, did you let the trigger resolve? No, I'm still. Okay. Cool. Just click cast. Tapping it. Just tapping it for no reason. I was like, I don't think that's how it works. 
You're allowed to tap it. I mean, Just sure, we're out. allowed to tap it, but... Exiled reanimate. Have to see. Reanimate is actually like that's pretty spicy. Animating our own fast, guaranteed the fastest oracle remaining. Let's see how it goes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Must. Um. Yeah. I mean, you just play a stoneforge mystic and hit them for one. I mean, it's a mate. I don't have to get the other half. Well, you may as well at this point. We've already got one in play. One. Somewhere in our deck is a pure steel paladin waiting to come out. The thing is, we have we I I I still think we're not out of this, but I think we've slowed them down just enough that we might be okay. But this is my this is always my fear with a deck like this is because it just it can sometimes just kill you up now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, you've got to try and like give them as little time to top deck as possible. There's a piece. Yep, you play it and you equip the hammer to the um, ornithopter. Oh, yep. And say so you're dead next turn, opponent. Oh. Oh my god, we don't have three artifacts. We don't have malcraft. We don't have malcraft. Oh, it's okay. That's next turn, and next time we deploy hammers, and they die anyway. Yeah. yeah. Do they have this turn to kill us? Mm-hmm. They have to kill us next turn. Because then we're going to attack for like 30. Yep. Okay, opponent. We've and got... spread the hammers out as well, which is good. Be like, here's 10, 10, 10. Mm-hmm. There are passing. Good for us. So they've used... Okay, so how many Force of Vigors have they used? Let me double check. They've used three. They've used three. Okay, yeah. so I think we're still fine. Force of Vigor doesn't save oh, no. it. The Zarok keep. Okay, oh. uh, play the Saga first. Saga? See if they want to Force of Vigor with its trigger on the stack. Yeah, no. nope. yeah, because if they've got it, this is when they'd use it. So, Hammer. One Hammer. The annoying thing is we're drawing cards off the trigger, which means we can't equip immediately. Which is sometimes why you want hammers down before Paladin. Okay, so let the trigger resolve. Yes. Force. Okay, now you go equip Ornithopter, equip Stoneforge. And then you want to play the third hammer. Hey! Yay! Did it. Okay, we have some cards. And there's no equipper, you have to ship it. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. I will. I, I was looking gonna go get hands, not too bad, but. Yeah, these are the classic trap hands. Okay. You right. can't keep it. Oh, mulligan. Uh, do do do. So Saga Ornithopter Opal doesn't get metal craft. We're on the draw. We have how many lands? Um, twenty something. Uh, how many artifacts that cost one or zero mana? Uh, a decent chunk. I think you have to keep it. You're not happy about it. You ship back the second opal. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Uh, because any land, any artifact. Is that we can cast makes this hand functional. It has an equipper, it has a Stoneforge Mystic, it has a Muffer of Runes. So it's mono red? red? Yeah, am I yeah. yeah, mono red? I don't like the fact that we're leaning on her as a saga against mono red, but here we are. This is the world we live in. Planes off the top one time. One time, one time, but that is an S percent. Uh, uh that is an artifact that we cannot cast. Um Okay, I mean, you have to play your cards face up. So, lead, lead, uh, Opal, Saga, Ornithopter, that order. Okay. Go. Go. Good. 
No. Oh, we're playing against goblins. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, we might just be dead. I mean, when they just shove goblin on turn two, sometimes it just doesn't hit. But of course, it hits the immediate six. The... That play's often not that good because it can miss, but... This isn't actually, like, I mean... Unless they're gonna, this is a go again. Yeah, they're gonna go matron. Two name sticker goblins. All right. Cool. That probably means they have like battle cry in hand. They just need like full mana. Um. Okay. Uh. We got to we got I mean, to do some things. Do get okay. How do how do we possibly win here? Um we can go land Esper Sentinel, Mystic for Hammer. Yeah. And that sets up pure steel hammer equip hammer next turn. Yes. Um that's probably our best opportunity, though we probably are dead. Okay, so go Sentinel. Esper Sentinel. Stoneforge Mystic. Yeah, I mean, this sets up technically lethal next turn, but I kind of doubt it works. Uh, yes. yes, get a hammer. Get a hammer. Yeah, we have to hope we're not dead. And if we're not dead, then we can potentially win next turn. Okay. If we're not dead... Alright. Big F. Big but... F. I think we Five. Should chain them into uh, okay. Oh. Well, I, they just need a hasty threat, don't they? Uh, leader. They hit another ringleader. If they ringleader into ringleader, we survive and kill them. So, really hoping for that. One ring? Oh, okay. Um. Okay, well, the, let's draw a card. Mm -hmm. I mean, this means we can't kill them, which means well, we're in a bad it. spot. I'm wondering? So I've seen this happen it's recently. so greedy. Okay. Okay. Uh, how big is everything? Ten, so ten, twelve. But this is ten. Yeah. So you chump the Muxus with the Stoneforge Mystic, and I think you leave everything else. So we're taking two forces. Yep. One ring. We'll see. Probably. Probably. But... Right. Okay, go to our main phase. Keep on. Yeah, I would. Uh, yeah. I mean, S Sarah, you know how we feel about this girl. Uh... <laughs> my opponents always hit, my ones always miss. That's, that's how I feel. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just, yeah, like. Uh... Okay, uh, so float. float. float yep. Get a... You get a hammer. Then use the floating mana to play the other hammer. And, uh, there's no point, they're not going to have anything instant speed, so play the pure steel first. Because that allows you to draw a card. The reason you deploy hammers before pure steel is the weird priority dance. But if they're not a deck that does anything at instant speed, and then play you a hammer. Well... Yep, play another hammer. Yeah. Oh, there's a chance maybe we're meant to get Shadow Spear. Oh, huh, that's interesting. Um, okay. Uh, planes. Mum. And mum, yeah. I mean, we can equip to just survive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you equip one on Esper Sentinel. And you equip one on Mother Runes. Uh, maybe Ornithopter. Ornithopter, actually. Ornithopter is the one we need to have survive. 
Okay, well now we just pass. Mm-hmm. I mean... No, we need a... Oh, yeah, the draw with the shot Destroying the Stoneforge Mystic means we actually might have been meant to get Shadow Spear, so we get Life Link to survive. Yeah, that's fair. That's my bad. Okay. I mean, I mean that's... I mean, like... Alright, we'll draw a card. We get to draw a card. Unless you pay 11, opponent. You can pay 11. Feel free to pay 11, please. Other Marxists. Okay. Okay. Yep. Watch your flips. There's a battle cry goblin. Do you have any more mana? No more mana. Oh, we might be. Oh, we might be able to. Oh my God, Sarah, we might live. Are we living. Eleven, eleven. I mean, which are uh, you double block on a Hopter Aspis animal? Just kill the Esper Sentry. Sure. It doesn't matter too much to us which one they kill. Yep. Cool. Good stuff. We are we? Sarah. What is happening? I believe they're dead. Um, okay, so go to our turn. Oh my <laughs> How did you just not attack? I mean, even if they attack, they die. <laughs> my <laughs> brain's, my brain's honestly just blown at the moment. My brain is just like, oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm very surprised that worked. Okay, all right. Swords um, to plowshares. Yeah, March of Otherworldly Light as well. March of Otherworldly Light to kill this damn Mux. Oh, uh, cut, Sophie! Cut Sophie's going to be... Of... Really? I think you actually cut Sophie. She's way too slow. Like, sure. this is not what Sophie's for. Uh... Same with, same with Lion Sash. Way too slow. I'm very excited about Sophie for a second. Um, uh, da, 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 da. Is, it, is it time, yeah. Sarah? Is it time? Ooh. They've got so much mana, I don't think it's actually good. Uh, I mean, we saw our opponent jam exactly Goblin into Moxus yeah. to the point where Ty Surge, becomes... Surge is going to be... It's creatures you control, so we can... We cannot... It can defend from Fury. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. like the big thing. You cut Retrofit Foundry, yeah, yeah, that's, that's a Dirtle card. Uh, you cut Nettlesis, that's a Dirtle card. True. Um, I think, probably still stays in. Yeah, it's difficult. So it's three more cards now? Yeah, yeah. We don't have to, um, we don't have to play as Mount Tyves. I would just put it in the main deck. Mount Tyves is up here. Okay. Yeah, sure. Uh, it's probably this, then. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Chalice on one is going to be a bit of a... Yep. That's the main thing to worry about. Just happens. I'm sorry. Like... I think on the draw, I think... I wonder if we bring this in back on the play. Manus Maybe. Yeah, yeah. On the draw, Maybe. I think this is on the play. Yeah, like sometimes they're going to charge you on one and you need your Urza Saga to go get the hammers or you need to Stoneforge Mystic in the hammers. Like, it happens. This like, is it sucks, Sarah White. But... How did we even. Oh. Oh. Uh, da, da, da. No a... equipper. No equipper. Just... But we do have the Source of Power shares, which is really important. Um... Maybe. Ooh. I hate no equip hands. Uh, they're I... soft and bad. Uh, let me let me think. Sorry. Um, planes, planes on a mom. Uh, Do we even go mum? Do we even go mum? We just go planes on a Oh yeah, sorry, they're on the play. Yeah. Um, yeah, you probably don't do mum then. Like we can, uh, we can, we can ship it. I mean, I'm happy to ship it. I just, I think. Yeah, having... can we ship to six one time? I think the six is there better than this. This is way better. Okay, heavy. Um, what do you want? What do you want then? You want to put cut this Esper Sentinel? No, you need the artifact count. Okay. Uh, you probably cut the. It's one of the equippers because you only need one. Um. Got you. Da, 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 da. It's probably pure steel. We okay. currently don't have the metal to play That's pure fair. steel. So keep put pure steel back, mm -hmm. and then I 
Having, having Caracas is going to be is pretty bull, though. All right. I mean, they still got the trigger as the thing. That's the annoying. triggers. It just means we don't. Yeah. Okay. Upkeep. I don't think what artifact hate they have. Okay, you go Caracas Opal Paths. Mox Opal. I say the turn. Mm -hmm. Don't mind us! We just got a correct. Really want to kind of draw an artifact land. That'd be great. You don't. You, you can battle crush? Sure. That's fine. This, if this is, this is the way they're going to play magic. Mm -hmm. uh, Ornithopter would be great. Amazing. Ammo would be great. Can, I, can we have our upkeep, please? Please and thank you. Please and thank you. Oh, it's like, I'm really thinking about your upkeep. <laughs> so. Saga. This is too many cigars. Um, just go land go. Just go saga go. What was oh, it? Oh, jeez. Uh, probably. Yeah. Uh, it's annoying that we don't have another artifact at the minute. Like sentinel. Um, if we had another artifact, then we could deploy sentinel and have the opal up. Yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah, I think it's with Saga Go. I don't think you can do anything else. Yeah, we've drawn, we've drawn, we've got a glut of equippers and not enough to do. I mean, this is kind of like, sometimes mm -hmm. that happens. In these yeah, any A plus B combo, sometimes you drew too, draw too much A and not enough B. Put a column A, put a column B. All right, fun. what are you doing? We still have these swords up, so I'm not, I'm not worried. Because if this is the speed that they want to go at, this is fine. From Mox. Okay. Show yourself. Bomber? They put Bomber on this, Sarah. Sarah, no, Sarah don't, don't you put a bomb. Is this the one rank? Okay. Well, we, uh, killed, we just killed You kill with the stack. Yeah, with yeah. It's ability on the stack, yeah. Yep. Shoot! Thank you. I have a feeling that hand is like Fury, Muxus, one other thing. Yeah. So hopefully the Muxus is stranded. Now. They put Bomber under this Chromebook there. You know how we feel about yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. It's a good card. Surge of Salvation. Um. um yeah, I mean, we have no choice now. We need to start deploying things. Uh, so start with the Sentinel. Um, just we just have to pass, yeah. Next turn we get more mana, which is we nice. We do get more mana than God. Not God, we just get more mana. Okay, we'll see. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't think they'd want to... Okay. Another battle cry. That's fine. Okay. Pack for two? We ain't, we ain't, we ain't blocking. I mean, the weather's warm. What are you worried about? I wonder if they think we have solitude. Probably. Like, in a deck like this, I've, actually, I'm surprised you don't play solitude, but I think maybe just the, the, the white count is a bit, um... Yeah, it, it really depends. Like, there are builds in, in modern where you play solitude and there are builds where you don't. Mm-hmm. I think in the Goblins meta game, it probably is pretty good. Yeah. All right, ancient then not bad. Oh my god! Okay, tap so, that. Tap this for mana. Mhm. Mm get. What do you want to get? Uh, it's kind of hard to know at the minute. Um, I'm thinking. Is this Shadow Spear? Probably. Or Ornithopter? We can get Ornithopter. Yeah, Ornithopter is also not the worst shout. Um, these are our choices: Shadow Spear, Ornithopter, Mox Opal, Hammer. 
I think you get Shadow Spear in this case. It's annoying that we had to hold swords up in the way we did, where we couldn't have a cigar design down already. So... Um, yeah, so you just go, like, Ancient Den. Put the Shadow Spear? Uh, no, I don't think so. Not yet. Just... Uh, so just... Oh, yeah, we've got one mana flowing. Yeah. Okay, uh, play, like... Yeah, equip Shadow Spear to Esper Sentinel, and then tap the non Caracas land to attach... To place a god aside. So it's mox, use the mox opal mana. To shadow spear. Yep. To play this. We have a 2 2 with lifelink. And then you play cigar aside. Then we've got surge up for. Yeah, for if they try and fury our board. Uh, yes. Cigar aside. Yes, cigar aside. And then we've got Brackus up for. One. Yep. And then we pass. Don't mind us, opponent! This card's interesting. I kind of I'm surprised it doesn't get seen doesn't see more play in mm -hmm. in Legacy. Goblin? Draw a name stacker. Rabble, rabble Rabble. Okay, Rabble's fine. Mm -hmm. Like again, if this is if we're just playing free drop tribal, we we can I've got you on this. Alright, so these are gonna attack. So they're only gonna have five power. That's fine. So we can block the 1-1 one, one for... Yeah, yeah, and then we gain 2. Three. Go back up to 20. And then take 4. So we go to 16. Then we... Flare blocks. Block here. Go to 16. Mm-hmm. Next turn is when they start getting a lot of goblins. Uh, okay. Um, play planes go. Like, you play planes, you play another ride. Um, but yeah. I mean, we have surge to not completely. This. Okay, once. How has this game got grindy? How has this match I've got grindy? How does game two get grindy? Okay. Now you have a million mana. Maybe five, actually. There comes the marks. Uh... Five mana. Hmm. Crash Master. Ooh. That's pretty good. Okay, we're gonna hope to get a trick on o over them. Make uh, it doesn't quite work either. Um, okay, how much are coming in? 8, 11, 14, 16, 18, 20. This might just be lethal, isn't it? Uh, you have to block the rubber master. Yeah. So, declare the block first. They could have lethaled us, but didn't. Um, you play Surge, and then they probably just destroy our guy in response, but... Can't do anything about it, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. GG's. GG opponent! Crash was a very good for them. Yeah. Okay, um... Bring these in on the play, I think. Sure. Uh, and then what do we cut? That's the other thing. It's like, what do we cut? It's like... Okay, probably Trim Forge in you. It's the most expensive card in Adapt by a lot. Um, we, don't need, we don't need all three. We might not need three. We might need no, two. have two in. Um, and then it's one more Trim. You need a lot of zero mana artifacts to support our thing. Um, do, 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 do. Thinking. Shave like a 
<laughs> you can't shave Stoneforge. Um, honestly, uh, shave a planes. Shave a planes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If we're shaving anything, it's that. On the boat. Uh. No equipper ship up. On six, you can't be too picky. Um. Right, you put silent clearing back. Yeah. And you lead us with Sentinel. And hope that we draw a million cards. Gemstone caverns. Goddamn. <laughs> okay. I mean, I'm not surprised. I, I would be playing. Yeah, I know. It's just unfortunate that they have that. Um. Mm-hmm. Okay, last turn. Getting... Oh. Okay, don't let it hit sex. One let time. Let there be some justice in the world. Nope, there's no justice. How, man? I swear to God, if I ever do this, it never hits it. I know. I mean, it's fine. Like, it might not have much. It's fine. I've accepted this is part of our format now. I just move on. <laughs> I just, I just kind of, I just kind of let it wash through me and go, okay. Opponent. It's just. The three times they played the card, it's hit six every yeah, single but it's time. Fine. That's they, just... I'm happy for them. Oh, they played Bomber. Oh, Bomber's good. Bomber yeah, means our stuff is good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Bomber. Oh, wow. This is still pretty good. Our Spacental is definitely dying. Yeah. Third. Mm -hmm. okay. okay um uh, you have to lead huh. just saga aid go yeah i'm thinking because if you play missed it they're definitely gonna bomber it um I'm trying to think how we can get a creature to stick. I think okay. I guess I guess you just have to go aid this turn, hope we top deck a land, and that's how you get a creature to stick. Okay. Uh so aid saga go. Oh, technically this can make Mother of Rune stick next turn, even if we don't draw a land. Give me Spirit Guide? That's... The one ring. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna have, like, a 10-10 creature, so... Yeah, love to see it. Cavern? I'm Goblin, okay. I mean, they've got one card in hand, so, I mean, they've got one ring, which is kind of... Yep. What it is, but... But we at least stabilise the immediate board next turn. Um... Okay. That's fine. Uh, so you go Mother of Runes, Colossus Hammer. They need to have, like, Pyrokinesis, which they can't have because they've only got one card in hand. So Colossus Hammer, equip Colossus Hammer to the mom. Yes, I'd love to equip. Mm -hmm. And then we pass. Then we get... Yeah, if we top deck a land, we can get, like, 21, 22 power trample lifelink, which hopefully is good enough. No trash man, please. Fine. I would love for you to not play trash man. That's not a trash man. That is it's a ringleader. Okay. They can't. I think we can beat 
screen later. Another ring leader and a bomb. Okay, this is fine. So the hand is bomber, bomber, ring leader. Play it for two. We go to two. Nache had someone the other day try to block like four times. How it works. It has that line of text, unfortunately. Are you t dealing a six? Okay, that's fine. Okay. That's not... Okay, so we need to think. Oh, give me a second. So, if we tap Saga, we can get Shadow Spear. Um, Shadow Spear auto-equips. And then we go, like, Stoneforge, hope that we can kill you next turn. Or. Or. I think. <clears throat> Sorry. Uh, da, da, da. We definitely need Shadow Spear. Yeah, yeah, I think we have Shadow Spear for sure. Um, yeah, well, the thing is, sometimes you can look up another bit of mana and then you play the Stoneforge for the Shadow Spear. Because um, one of the way. Mox Opal currently isn't on, which Correct. is annoying. Uh, what other bits of mana do we have? I need to look at the deck list. I, okay, um, I don't want to complicate this. I genuinely think we just get Shadow Spear from this Urza Saga. Okay, just click OK, but don't pick what comes off. Let me look at the options. Okay, so, yeah, Opal isn't on. Okay, it's Shadow Spear. Yeah. Done. We get Shadow Spear. That goes there. Yeah. Yep. Yes. We have a soft off trample legend. Uh, you play the Stoneforge Mystic. You don't want to hold up swords. We have a source of plowshares. This is my only thinking is that. Okay, so what are you afraid of? So we're about to gain tw 12 life. Um, we're about to go. They they have to block. My concern, my, my. They can block, yes. So they've got, so how much mana do they have? They have two, three, four, uh, two, four, five. Like, my concern is just dying to Bomber, and they just kind of attack, and then they just throw a bunch of stuff at us, and we die. But then they we can all... deal 18 in one turn. Um, let me... Can they deal 18? Two... So if they go Bomber, and say another card in their hand is another Soul Land. Yeah, yeah. So they go Bomber, Ringleader. That's two, four, six, eight, ten, and then double chuck is lethal. Yeah. Um. Like Bomber does a lot of damage on. Like it does a lot of damage. That's why I'm like I'm happy attacking because then we go back to eighteen, and then we say go, and then we can just swords something. Bef we can just swords pre combat. Okay, sure. Let's let's go. Who's the man? If we had an extra mana, I would do the Stoneforge thing, but because we don't, we mm -hmm. have to use... But the point is now, Stoneforge is cut off forever, which is why we had to think about it. I think, I think we've got... This is our game plan at the moment. Mm -hmm. If we die, if we die, we die. Put you to one. Say go. Mm -hmm. I play ringleader. A bomb. Okay. Okay. Still dead. Well, no, because we're gonna kill one of the bombers. Yep. Just let it come in. We kill it at exact beginning of combat. No, not in main phase. Why not? Because you don't want them to be able to cast something else. With one let, them card the of, the, the, let them go to the beginning of combat. The one card is Goblin Ringleader, Sarah. Just correct technical play. Okay, go to beginning all right, of combat. Alright, alright, alright. Okay. I, I, I agree with you, but I... Now sorts. Okay. Kill the one that's here. One? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Mm-hmm. Yep. Go to three. Okay. 
two, four, six. Go to. Are we still dead? Maybe. Just there's nothing we can do at this point. Yeah, yeah we're dead. Yeah, GG. That's unfortunate. There's, I think, honestly... If there was only one bomber, yeah, we yeah. live. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I, I'm honestly surprised we even got to that far. Like, I, mm. I think if it was like... Yeah, I think the third bomb... Yeah, like, this is, you know, they... I think that match was closer than we probably had any right to, to be close. Um, But yeah, that's fine. Okay, folks, we'll see you in round three. Okay, uh, Quipper, Stoneforge, Mystic, two flyers. Uh, you keep this. Lead on Saga? Um, planes. Planes, because it's non-wastelandable and we need Stoneforge, Mystic. I think we're, we're playing against our Delver opponent. Yeah. Volcanic Island, go. Planes. So planes, Sagada's Aid. Yeah, because we got backup Sagada Zade, this is fine. You want to daze it upon him? Yep. Makes sense. Uh, and just drop your Ornithopters. They're like... Okay. Okay. We're playing magic, right? We're, now we're playing it. I mean, right now we've had the exp we've got Delver, Goblins, and Oops. So we've had we've got the full range of legacy right now. It's the same volcanic hunt. Okay. Um. Okay, they've already dazed us once. They have already dazed us once. That's true. I think we can play around days now. So I think we just go Saga, Aid. Yep. And then next turn we can get the Stoneforge into Hammer. Yep. How's it? Swing with both. Send a message. Yeah. <laughs> Wanna see if they get scared. Okay. They did not get scared. They were like, oh. No fear? We could have tend you. There it is. Cool. Yeah, that makes sense. We still can play magic though. Mm-hmm. They haven't deployed a threat yet, no. so. Okay, um you play Ancient Dun and you don't do anything else. Attack for zero. Um <laughs> still attack for zero. Yeah, attack for zeros. We are playing against Delver, I'm not playing mad. Probably, yeah. Yeah, like Delver, like, ain't seen a threat, but... Mm -hmm. I'm getting a little suspicious. To be well, I think they're like, well, I have to play the control role here, which is probably right. Uh, Silent Clearing, Stoneforge... Use Don't pay the life. Just use the other two. Okay. Wanna counter this stone forge? They wanna Makes counter sense. the stone forge. They're gonna force the stone forge. What? Raisin bar? Okay, it is bar. Right. Yeah. Keep attacking for zero. <laughs> Just mm -hmm. keep attacking. Like, excuse me. Beep beep. Don't mind us. We are technically winning this race. Feel like a Merc Tide. We can be a Merc Tide. Okay. Uh. Just, just let it go. We wouldn't even really be happy surging here. They don't tend to play Fury main, so... They don't play Fury full stop, it's just a holy hits of them. 
Mm -hmm. I mean, I've seen Fury in some weird sideboards, but that's yeah. people trying to have coping. Living their best life. Uh, you have to just jam the Stoneforge now, I think. We've already got one force out of them. I have two. Okay. The hammer. Namesake of the deck. Mm -hmm. Still attacking for Zoom. Oh god, yeah. Every time. Every time. Just turn them. Just turn them sideways. This is where I want like a white spirit guide. So. <laughs> I don't ask for much. A white spirit guide would be great. Or a Yavamaya, like a Yavamaya style effect. That oh, got, oh, it's Grixis. Okay, good. Oh. You want to make you want to make green white depths that good, huh? Just I would I would like I don't just play I just play it in like initiative little decks like this. No, agree oh, yeah. make, the, make the deck ma Dex mana not squeaky mm. Squeaky and or creaky I'm playing in Scrixes Okay, so we have to worry about Molten Collapse I mean, that was the justification behind Red Green Initiative, right? It was like, you could play Yafamaya And 8 Spirit Guys Yeah, yeah. Alright, Pony, what are you doing? You got a million things oh. Holy Moses Is this the game? Is this our game? Okay mm. Three wastelands. You got one left, heavy B. We'll still play magic. Don't mind us. Land. Damn it. Uh... You want to jam? To a probable date? Talking Thinking. Uh, I think we have to jam. Uh, reason being, I want their resources to go down. Um, and then if we draw another land, we can put in... Now it's just off Stoneforge Mystic, Correct. so it's uncounterable, uh, which is decent. Ooh. Equip Ornithopter. White boy. Our favorite boy. This it's is where it gets bolted. bolted. <sighs> Stifle. Okay, whatever. Don't. Why don't really are you stifling the trigger? Oh, Sarah. Stifle is actually very good right now. I will. I will. Uh, we're just attacking. Yep. Um, Stifle weirdly good right now. Actually, not the worst. Stifling like uh, a tractor trigger is pretty spicy. I've got my Bachelor stifled way too much in the uh, past week. They are very good. Eventually, opponent, you'll play a threat, and it might be now. Lucky tide. Lucky. That's fine. Yeah, it happens. Still haven't played a threat. They still so... haven't played a threat. What are you doing, Happy B? You're just playing Grixis Control. Well, that's good. That's good. That's mm -hmm. good. You that... play Saga, then you play another raid. Sarah, they've got rid of all of the. They've got rid of three wastelands. Mm -hmm. What is the chance that they had another way? <laughs> Don't say that. I mean, we Don't have to. We have to. That. I mean, we have to. You know. Still attacking for zero, opponent. Like mox opal. Like mox opal would be like an absolute like hella draw. Opals of draw. Pond. Fred? Fred? No Fred? They chose to shuffle. Okay, so Mistress Bob. Okay, it is down. Okay. Somewhere in their deck is a Fred. This is a thing that Hammer does to people where they get like, oh god, oh god, oh god, and they never actually start clocking you back, so yeah, you yeah. just get infinite time to Feels do like whatever. It. Does feel like it. Um, Not the best, but it's fine. You go to combat, and then you do it in combat for fun. Oh! What, the Shadow Spear? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Keep Surge of Salvation up as oh. well, which is nice. That's spicy. 
gain some life. So we can get another hammer next turn. So that's good. What are we doing now? Let them do blockers. And now you flash in off the circuit. Flash! Ah! Whiteboarded sun. Yeah, yeah, we'll do on the whiteboard one. Bolt? One free, Sarah. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> now our sun can attack. You love to see it. Sarah, look at our one free sun. I want to fuck the sun. Look. Oh, Sarah, they finally found a frip. Wonderful. I love to see it. Mm. Found a free free. They've got a free free. Okay. I think we might be able to race a free free. I, I, Just... I also think we can. Alright. Untap upkeep. Okay, you float the one off saga. Get the losses hammer. Yep. Uh, on the other side? Okay. No, no, on the one with Shadow Spear. You pile up on this beautiful child. Stifling the truth. Okay. Again. That's fine. That means we get to play an Atal Cyst now. Ooh. Okay, Ancient and Dan. Then... Atal Cyst. Look at our sun is. Uh, how big is Nails? Ooh. Okay, sure. Right, pony. I mean, I don't think we had a choice. No, no, we had to do it. No. Uh, we can't attack. Nope. We can block this Darcy. I don't think you want to. No, I don't think so. Maybe not. Yeah. So it was definitely online. I think you're strong with the Ornithopter. The one with Life Link and Travel? Yep. We equip it to the other one? Move it to. Yeah, I think so. Engine down. Yep. They've stifled two of our hammer troops. <laughs> you love to see it. It's fine, we're just gonna top deck a pure still ballot. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's the that's the I mean I'll happily I'll even take like Stoneforge. <laughs> Any of our creatures are pretty live. Lurk tide? Nope. Another more. You swing with our last favourite son. Uh-huh. Mox Opal can be a surprise bit of mana when we need it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like float Mox Opal, do the painter thing with it. Mm-hmm. Um, I mean, we still have this surge, so, like, we're not completely, like... Honda? Oh, oh, they put Bowman in the bin. That's interesting. I suppose it's not really what they're looking for. Don't really. They choose to shuffle. Okay, so they are look. They are now looking for threads. This is the aggressive. The opponent is aggressively pondering. They're mm -hmm. pondering their orbs. Other deal. Now we're okay. Now they've got a clock.
Oh. That is. Uh, so float white off Mox Opal and then get Mox Opal. Now we look at them in the face and say, do you have a force of will? Keep this one. Mm-hmm. Let's keep this one. We'll just do off the Mox Opal, by the way. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Force of will? Force? Force, 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 force? Force of will? They're just staring. They're just going like, what? They can brainstorm. They don't know the card. They don't know the top card of our library because they shuffle from their ponder. Yeah, they choose to shuffle. Okay, that resolved. Okay, uh, equip a hammer to each. So on a pop, just start with the one on the trampler. Yeah, I might do that. They'll have surge up as well. Yeah, if they try and bolt the honor up to you, just let it go, and you equip to the others. Oh All my right. god! Ooh. Oh my god, Sarah! Oh dear! All right. Shaky oh. hands, shaky hands. Okay, Sarah. Um. So okay, I'm gonna bring some suggestions in. See what you think. Okay. Mm -hmm. Swords to plow shares. Culture complete. Um. Now, okay, Graveyard Hate with Delver, I have, it can be one or two ways. You can bring it in. So what do we see, what do we see as their threat? We saw DRC, um, it's just Grixis Delver, right? So it's what? Yep. Black Tide, DRC, Orphish Bowmasters, Delver, and... Mercury. Yeah. So the only one yeah. that doesn't... So, well, they're probably going to take their... They don't take their Bowmen out against us, because their Bowmen do nothing. Um... And we hope so. I mean, they're we gonna have, have melt, they're gonna have meltdown. Like Let's be worried about meltdown. Like we're gonna have to worry about meltdown. Um, we got surge. We got surge. We can, we can protect us. Do you want graveyard oh. hate? Now? Do you do you want like? No. Okay. I don't think so. I don't want to clam up our draws. Okay. Um, do you want? We need... Do you want to? No. Do you want to fight? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> do you want to fight back? Fight um, fire with fire. March. March is only good really against DRC and like it's not good against Merktide, but it's good against the other stuff. Yeah, let's just keep it lean for the first lean, game. Lean, mean, the fighting machine. Okay. So, cut, cut Lion Sash. Cut Retrofit of Foundry. I quite like Lion Sash, though. Lion Sash keeping Delirium off is still... It's so slow. It, it, I mean, we had time in that. We, we, had, we had time in that match. You're not going to have time when they have meltdowns. That's also um, true. Okay, that's fair. I... Yeah, it can be like a game one good card, but you still cut it. Um, I feel my analysis. Sophie? Sophie's got to stay in, right? Sophie's, this is literally what the matchup. <laughs> Sophie's built for this Delver deck. Da, da, da. Is it Nelsist? Is it Nelsist? Maybe. Um, this is just Pierce to Pile number five. Holder is a way mm. to just kill him quickly. Sophie is for the grinding matchup. It might just be Nettlesist, right? Well, and quite the grindy matchups. It might be Ornithopter. Yeah, that's uh, fine. Lower density of zero mana artifacts a little bit. Just kind of... Yeah, that's fine. So it can keep Nettlesist in. Yeah, we'll see for now anyway. Uh, we don't want Deafening Silence. It's not possible. Yeah. I, I think <laughs> Lion Sash... I could probably have made a case for Lion Sash, but I also understand. Uh, I think on the play, I'm more happy about it, but... Sarah. Mm. Sarah. Do you want to play some magic? Oh god, I think this is like the worst keep of all time. Um, Sarah, look at all these wastelands. Da, 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 there you go. Turn one Asper Sentinel. Turn two as a saga. You get wastelanded. You play. The issue is wasteland isn't very good against Delver. They want you to play that really low resource, resource scores game. game. It's uh, up so to I you. think you chip this. I I think if it was a matchup where Wasteland was better, I know I'm, I it, taking them off a of color is always like really attractive. All right, let's it see. it's a losing game I a know. lot of the time. Uh, this is much better. It is. Um, it is yeah. Da, 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 da. You probably put the nettle cyst back. Yeah. And you go turn one. Planes, Opal, Hammer, Go. We don't have Metal Cross. 
Yes. Oh, it's because oh, we don't have them. Ignore me. All right, opponent. All right, let's see what they do first. You are correct. I was not. Uh, right, opponent. Show us your secrets. Please show us your secrets. And go. No threat. Okay, I that's love to good. See that means they're probably holding up my like, bolt. Oh, that's so helpful. Okay, so um, we just play our turn one play, right? Yeah, so planes, opal, and then a hammer. Just be like, okay. You want to play meltdown? Sure. You take two of us. Okay. Past turn. So I have a controversial take. Mm -hmm. I actually think we, for, if we go Stoneforge, I think we get cauldron. I think we try and close the game quickly. Potentially. But then they just bolt your Stoneforge and you have a card that does nothing. I think it's more likely to be Nettle Cyst in this exact situation. Ooh, that's, that's a good one. Um, okay. Da, 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 da. We have Metalcraft, but not yet. We have to play it. You can get Metalcraft, but it exposes you to Wasteland really hard. I mean, to... Meltdown really hard. We just got Saga. Um, we just play Saga Stoneforge. Yeah, Saga Stoneforge getting that assist actually seems fine. Or we just... It's probably going to get dazed or bolted. That's fine. So... Um, yeah, the other option. Yeah, I think we play Saga. Play Stoneforge. I don't. Like, if it gets dazed, so be it. A nettle cyst? Yes. We can't afford to have dead cards at the minute. Like, Cauldra is very, very good. Uh, but it is. But I agree with you. I think you get it when you have protection of some sort. Okay, if we had like a surge in our hand, then that'd be. Okay. Um, if we draw land, then we could start making some constructs. Kind of. Oh, brainstorm ends. The oh! Legacy brain. Oh, is this a legacy brainstorm or a vintage brainstorm? It's a legacy it one. It is a legacy brainstorm. Although, although apparently you're not meant to do it at end step because you can. No, because you don't get a card as deep. Exactly. But if you're gonna fetch, it's fine. They didn't fetch. There, there. The... Strange brainstorm. Darcy. Okay. There is a threat. You love to see it. Another one. Another one. Another one. That's fine. Well, they've well, they've, they've they've put their they've put their um they put their ducks in a row. Now yep. know what to, we don't now know what to play around. And you still didn't fetch heavy. So interesting. Caracas. Oh, that's actually good. That's actually not the best. Okay, so you go Caracas and then you pass. We pass? Yeah. Oh, because we put Nettle Cyst in and we can put Nettle Cyst well, we can Yeah, we can also make a construct. Yeah. There's a bunch of stuff yeah. we can yeah. do. So we say... If they crack their fetch, I think you activate Stoneforge in response so they don't have Stifle. Correct. It sucks to not get constructs, but also, like... Okay, um... Actually, maybe it's make a construct. Make uh, a construct. Which is better, make a construct or Nettle Cyst. Well, uh, so the nettle cyst is going to be one, two, uh, is a three, three, and our constructs are also going to be a three, three. Make a construct, because that way, if they melt down, we still have the permanent threat in our hand. Hey, meltdown! Oh, so much mana. They're not attacking. They can't. I don't think. Bolt the stone fall. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Leave a card on top. They got three cards in hand? They do have three cards in hand. 
Are you ready to go all in? I am <laughs> right. so ready to go all in. Okay. Okay, go draw. Drawing. I'm drawing. S percent. Okay, I think we go all in. Okay. Um, tap the Urza Saga. All mana? Yeah. Let this come up. What do you want to get? Shadow Spear. Love Shadow Spear. Now you tap your Caracas and your Mox Opal. And still. you play pure steel paladin. Look at our human knight, son. It doesn't really have the same ring to it, Sarah. Okay, you equip hammer first to construct. Beep beep. Then you equip shadow spear to construct. Then you play Colossus Hammer with the floating man. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Then uh, you draw a card. Brazen Borrow is going to happen. I'm warning you ahead of time. But here we are. You have Borrower? Don't make us wait, have you? I'm just. I mean, they don't borrow now. They borrow once oh you swap. Oh my god! Let's <laughs> go! Let's go, Sarah! Sarah, I'm not gonna lie! I've been, I'm impressed! I'm getting more and more impressed, okay? Even the Goblins matchup was close, alright? The Goblins matchups were close, this matchup was close. Ooh! Folks, we'll see you in round four. Right, folks, we're playing against Lightwalker. Uh, ooh! <laughs> this painter? There is the painter. Card. Lightwalker is usually a painter player, yes. Yeah, yeah, okay, so we're playing against painter. Okay. We can't, uh, we can't really. da, da, da. Uh, Yeah, if we had another zero mana artifact, this is a keep. Yeah, we might uh, this is Yeah, if this is what I think it is, this is a painter nerd. Um, mm -hmm. again. We have an equipper, we have Stoneforges, this is a keep. What do you want to put back? Stoneforge? Uh, put back the Shadow Spear. Show. Sure. Yeah, that one we need it. All right, let's see what let's see what opponent's up to. Oh, it's us first. Uh, yep, you just go planes go. Nice planes, nice planes. Well, nice planes. Make them think you're deaf and taxes. Deaf and taxes. If we are. I wonder if like walkers on cauldron these days, or if Ooh, they're still no, it. All right, walkers. Okay. Go walkers going straight for the juggler. Mm-hmm. How's the painter matchup? They can't be bad. God, I have no clue. Uh, yep, jam your Stoneforge off Saga. Off Saga. You want Saga developed. Because it can get a Shadow Spear or a Hammer for you. Yeah, nice. Get Hammer. Mm hmm. <laughs> we just say to. We've just made. Both of us have told each other this is how the game's going to go. One of us is gonna die. One of us is dying. Oh, look They're at in saga. Look okay. at like, look at like, are we dead? Oh, we might be dead. Oh, we're not dead yet. Right? Are you cauldron painter or are you normal painter? Lightwalk is a lightwalk is typically a cauldron. No, okay. Normal, normal painter. painter. Normal okay. painter. Okay. All right. Okay, so theoretically, we could be dead next turn. I mean, that's true. Um. Da, 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 da. So Goddess Aid is very helpful. Okay. Talk to okay. Um uh, dear, is there a sequence where we get to hit them for more? No, there isn't. I have to hit them for ten. Um. What are you thinking? No, yeah, we need like we need like one more mana. An extra mana, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, if they aren't comboing us next turn, we're in a good spot, but there is a chance of combo next turn. I mean, sure, then we, we did. Uh, yeah, there's nothing we can do about it. So, what's going to be, like, the best line? Ooh, ooh, one sec. Alright, what are you thinking? Because, yeah, it's either you go Sagada's Aid Hammer or Pure Steel Paladin Hammer. There's a, there's a funny line with getting Lion Sash, but we're still... We're still slow Wait, there. Yeah, we don't have enough to. Yeah, we don't. We're one mana short to get lion sash. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're still one mana short. 
let's let's get to draw a card because they're not going to have anything at instant speed. So play planes, play pure steel, and then play the Colossus Hammer. Yeah, I might do that. Don't sequence like this way normally, folks. It's only because Paya doesn't really instant speed interact at this point. Okay. okay, and then you just pass. And then we're threatening lethal next turn. Oh, hold on. What? We should have played Sagarda's Aid. We don't have Metal Crawl. We will next turn. We will next turn, you are correct. Yeah, that's the whole point. Like, we can't kill them this turn. So are we dead? No, that's not combo mana. That is not combo mana. They need an angel. Okay. Do you have, like, a million... Spirit guides? Things to do. Yeah. Like, I mean... Or is I mean, they've probably got Hydro Blasts. Uh, I mean, Pirate Blasts. Okay, so go to our turn. That's a good trigger. Okay, float one. And then let the trigger resolve. You get... Okay, we need to think through the entire turn with this on the stack. Okay, okay let's assume they have exactly one Pirate Blast. Okay. For the sake of argument. So okay. can you lift up the thing a bit so I can see the board state? The other way. Oh. Uh, I need to see our board state. There you go. Um, okay. Um... We have two planes and all of... We have two planes and we have yeah. three available so, so if this gets... If this gets Shadow Spear, we get to play a Stoneforge Mystic and still have one mana up. Um... I wonder if we just hope to draw Surge of Salvation, and that's like the entire plan. Yeah, I'm not a person. I actually don't mind that. Okay, so can we still put Leaf on the board while having Surge of Salvation? So if we get Shadow Spear, yeah. we play Stoneforge Mystic to get another hammer. Then we and then we play hammer. hammer. We need we need to hit mana source. Surge. Yeah, off the two for this to work. If we get Mox Opal instead, you don't draw a card. That's just worse. Okay, no. yeah, we just have to go for it. Okay. So Shadow Spear. Shadow Spear. Trigger. Draw a card. Yep. Yes. Okay, that's the first part. So play Ancient None. Okay, before doing anything, we yep. do the equips. So equip to Stoneforge Mystic. What the hammer or the start hammer first. The rule generally is hammer first because if, they, if they're going to they kill, it... kill the paladin okay. in response to a trigger, you want the hammer to be okay. on there. So now shadow spear. Same thing. Yep. A novel. Yep. Okay. And then okay, now tap ancient done. Play stoneforge mystic. We now can get lion sash, but then we don't have mana to. Uh, it doesn't matter because they have a painter on board. Lion Sash, the idea was to keep the other painter away. What are you thinking? Oh. What? Oh. Oh. What? 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 Get Sword of Fire and Ice. We don't have mana. No, no, get Sword of Fire and Ice. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting. Move the equipment to Pure Steel Paladin. Move what equipment? The Shadow Spear? The, all of it to Pure Steel Paladin. I didn't think of this as an out. Okay. Right, moving it. Oh, wait. Shit. Um... Well, no, because we... What, you want to activate Stoneforge? Yeah, but I just realised it doesn't kill the painter. Um... I was getting too clever about beating Pyroblast, and now I feel like we don't beat other things. I mean... Oh, I'm a fool. You're not um, a fool, we're still playing, come on. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay. What does Sword of Fire and Ice do when it hits people again? It deals two and you draw a card. Okay, what card could get us out of this? Right now? Not, yeah. a, not a lot. Yeah, we should have just got a hammer. I'm a fool. Um, mm -hmm. okay. Uh, play Ornithopter. 
You ever just get too clever for yourself? No, it's fine. Oh. Like, it's fine. Um, oh. oh, oh, oh. Okay. Play another Stoneforge Best deck. Well, you want to get it now? Yeah, I get the other hammer. Yeah, we're probably dead. Um, okay. We just attack. Yeah. Yeah, I messed up this time completely, but it's fine. I mean, the end of the world. Uh, yeah, they did you? Yeah, so there's no way to play around. Yeah, there's fire. Okay. Cool. Save our time. Let's save our Okay, so playing against Painter. Um, Mark I... of Otherworld. Yes. Swords to Plowshare. Yes. Don't need to. What do you want to cut? Uh, da, da, da. Okay. So the main thing we're going to have difficulty with is the combo. Yeah. If they just do a normal, if they just have a regular game, we might be fine. Yeah. So I think Retrofit Foundry goes away. Yep. I actually think Sophie goes away. It is Pyroblast Insurance, but that's about it. And if they've got a Painter on the board, you're under the gun anyway. Yeah. Um,. I think maybe even Nettlesist goes. Like, we're just gonna play, like, a really aggro plan. And well, then, like, shave uh, buff up to or something? Da, 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 da. I don't think we can, because we have to be aggressive, so we need zero mana artifacts. Um, but, like, like, I think Lion Sash probably just about good enough. Just to... just to prevent graveyard stuff, yeah. Though it's close. It depends how aggressive we want to be. I mean, we're on the play. I think we kind of have to kind of beep beep. Because there's a because there's an argument that you can cut Lion Sash and Forge in here and bring in Cauldra, um, yeah. to make a single Stone Forge just a threat. Not a first that if you want to do that on the play. Okay. Yeah, let's do that, and we'll see how it works. One sixty. Okay. Yeah. Oh, my brain. Sometimes I get too clever for myself. Well, let's not let's not get clever. Let's just play the magic. Let's play the magical cards. Uh. Mm. Mm. So you can go Wasteland, Opal, Fopta, Hammer, Mom. Mom. But the problem is then you've got a Hammer down, your only equipper is Sigurd as Aid. Um, I mean, I don't hate Oh, it's so close to being good. We just need like another land or another artifact that isn't Hammer. I think that's fine on the play. Yeah, go on. Don't play the hammer, though. No, no. Um, don't play the hammer? Don't play the hammer. Got the... Mm -hmm. the... Generally, you want to play Opal before or for artifacts, but it's fine. Yep. Um, pass? Mm-hmm. Wooded footers. Wooded footers. Yeah, we've started playing more thatchers these days than Go we on. used to. Sure. Okay, so we might have to hold up white this turn to prevent chaos defiler stuff. Okay, we have no choice anymore. So you tap wasteland, you play classes hammer. And then you pass. We can beat a goblin mob. One. I can beat one goblin mob. I'm thinking they go Great Furnace Engineer. Yeah, so they're gonna go get Chaos Defiler. But I think we can surge that trigger and then swords the Defiler afterwards. And that puts them behind a land. So I think we actually let that happen. Wanna let it? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because if we swords ahead of time, they go get like Phyrexian Dragon Engine instead. Oh, this game paint Ooh, Painter's Servant. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Um, well, Surge is still good, right? Because we don't die to paint. We don't die to the mill. Because we get hit. You, 
Oh, okay, yeah, it's full hexproof. Yeah. Sorry, I thought it was only hexproof to the certain colours. No, 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 right? no. So you and Terminus, you control getting hexproof until next turn. We don't just die. Yeah. Okay. That's good. So we go. Okay. On top of Keeve. Oh. Caracas. Okay, that's really good. So um. So you play Caracas. Yeah. There you go. Um. Need surge and swords up. Yeah. So just say go. They're probably not going to just go for it into. I mean, it is like Walker, so you know. <laughs> like... Wow. <laughs> I I all sh props to Light Walker, but Light Walker loves loves the jam. Exactly. See. That's the grindstone. That's the grindstone. Okay. Like Walker loves a jam. Yeah, exact pain, case in point. Um, could yeah, we, you, could we wasteland um, the great foes? Then they weld. Then in they response. weld. Them. I think we just stay go right. Yeah. Because yeah. this way, as long as we hold wasteland up, they can't actually weld then with great furnace. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Uh, if you tap, Car all right. Don't do it. But I'm just thinking. If we tap Caracas, play aid. Yeah. They weld into painter. They get to do it twice. They get to do it on our end step and on the next. No, they don't because we have wasteland. Right. right. Yes, they do because they activate ancient tomb. They weld out the grindstone for painter, but then we swords the painter. Correct. And we're fine. That's if they go for it now. If they don't go for it now, they untap, they activate Grindstone, weld in the pair. Okay, I think we're actually good to place a guard as I'd. Off the I think that's, Yeah, yeah, I think that's allowed. I think we're allowed to do that. We have, okay. okay. We have... Now we, now we pass. Still got this zero mana on the to don't mind us. Okay, they aren't going for it on our own stuff. They are going for it. What are they welding out? Great Furnace. Yes. You wasteland the Great Furnace. Work. Do you think they. Do you think that was more bait? It could be, yeah, but like yeah. we planned around this. Yeah, yeah. Now we have. If they can do it again. Okay. The point is that we're making them weld out the grindstone to do this now, which means that they then can't go for it the turn afterwards, hopefully. Okay. They're just going to keep going for it on like an end step, because that's actually probably best from them. It ties up our mana a bit more. So we on uh, do you want to play hammer? Their instead on on their instead. If we tap out, they combo us. On it. Yeah, because they can do it at instant speed. So we can't play hammer now. Wasteland is helpful. Play wasteland. There you go. Um. Yes. This is a this is a who blinks first kind of situation. It is indeed. Getting bad lands, basic round. Plateau. What a game! Yeah, it's red or white. Okay. Enlightened tutor. Okay, it's strawberry shortcake. All right. Something we do about that. Get your no. get pain. Okay, so they're going for it. They're just going for it now. Uh, you wasteland ancient tomb. Nope. Okay, they didn't. We didn't bait them into going for it. <laughs> oh, they have another one. Another That's why. One. <laughs> okay. I love to see it. Okay. Yep. Got two cards in hand. 
you don't currently have the mana. Okay, so you, so keep passing till they're unstuck. Why is it not attacking? On end step, you swords the painter. No. None of that, please. Horror blasted copy? Cat and mouse game we're playing, Sarah. It's like. Yeah, there's two combo decks trying to disrupt each other. Just like. Welds into the other painter. So yep, just, that's fine. So they're just welding one into the other. Yes. Fizzles. Yep. Okay. Uh, and still on their end step. Now we can tap because they don't have the mana to do the combo. Correct. Let's play a Colossus Hammer and get it onto a. Oh, oh it's sorry. Not, I thought uh, we went off the no, end step. No, 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 no. It was just. It, I was letting the. I was letting the swords. I was yep, letting, yep. I was letting the cool. swords result. Sorry. Listen. Because cool. We've keep... accidentally clicked for end step. No, no, no. I, I. Sorry. You, you scared the living. You scared the living Jesus out of a second. I was like, oh, whoa, I'm whoa, sorry. Whoa. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's I'm okay. sorry. That's all right. You're doing great. Okay. Um. I mean. You tap Opal to play Mom. Mother of runes. Okay, and now you swing for ten. Like to swing. Please and thank you. They probably feel pressured to block, actually. Which With is what? Fun. The welder? They take. Maybe. They take. Okay. It. That means they probably have a pyro blast in hand, which is unfortunate for the home team. It is unfortunate. For the home team. Did what we could. What we've got. Get you search. Are blasted? So be it. Yep. Okay, that's fine. All right, GGs. GGs. I don't hate. Okay. It. No, it's good. So we're doing it. Uh... You just go ancient Dan go on turn one. It could be Bomberman. Could be could Painter. Be anything. We could be anything. Even a book. We could even be Hammer Time. Could Wait. <laughs> Ancient Tomb? Sure. We just wasteland. Uh, no, I don't think so. I think getting our own mana under us is more important. Okay, you go Opal first. Then Ancient Dan. Then tap Ancient Dan and Opal to play Stoneforge Mystic. The reason you play you play it off Opal is it's the only one whose mana might be temporary. Right? Like if they wasteland, suddenly you can't hold up. I'm just getting hammer, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm just kill him dead. Kill him dead. Alright, we got we got source plowshares up. We're ready for you. Why are you? What? Oh, you. What? Hmm. What? Is this the. Show and tell? Is this show and tell? Is this. Hold on. Hold on. Laurie that revealed. Felt... Laurie revealed. The basic. That felt very show and tell to me. Basic Island? Is it come yeah. to do it? It could be show and tell. Oh, it is. Uh, oh, hold on. I mean, if it's, let's see, I'm, I'm still, it's not covered to jewel because they're not playing like 5 million artifacts. Could just be show and tell. My brain's like, oh, basically, okay, what about this? Yeah, it's show and tell. Oh, oh, I understand. Oh, we did. Maybe. We'll see. Uh, light resolve. Yeah, we'll let it resolve. You got one card in the library. Got one. Battle rocker. 
I mean, if they fast as Oracle right now without anything else, we just swords it. So. Sarah, mm -hmm. take a screenshot. Yeah, I got idea. Uh, do, 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 do. Impulse? Spell Seeker? Oh, there. Yeah, they're going to go for it next turn, which means that swords won't be able to save us. Um, can, we okay. do, can we do a million damage? I mean, if we draw another hammer, yes. We can. We can just kill them if we do that. That's not another hammer. Okay. Um, okay, well, we have to do the draw a card version of Pure Steel Paladin, which I hate. So tap two for Pure Steel Paladin. Yep. Play the Wasteland and then play the hammer. Play Wasteland. Play the hammer off Wasteland. Hope to God that we draw another hammer. Hmm. Okay, uh, we have to hope they fuck up somehow. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, equip that to Stoneforge Mystic and hit them for 10. I was really hoping they went for it that turn, like yeah, let us battle yeah. pass as Oracle, because then we could have just swords them and won. Um, then you go on a to pass. Look at our son. Okay. I do think this matchup is winnable. Oh yeah. This matchup is definitely winnable. Or we think it just. Oh, like we're dead here. Well, let's. Don't get well, me well, wrong. well, hold on. Let's. We did? No, we did. We did? Yeah, we did. Yeah. Alright. So being foracled in the face. Mm hmm Alright. Okay, well how do we M March is good. Mana Tive can be good. Deafening silence? <laughs> they don't tend to pay multiple spells in a turn. Um, no, but they can it they can do the whole setuping, like, you know, ponders and impulses. Than whatever, but then maybe. Mm -hmm. Um, I think mm, no, I don't think Aldra is how we want. So we cut sort of our nice analysis line sash immediately. We cut retrofit a foundry, probably even the shadow spear. The only creature is Farical. Um, they might um, they might board into. Well, I mean. Yeah, yeah, they will have Shadow Spear. I'm just saying, I wonder if they board into things like subtlety and things like that post board. I mean, if it happens, it happens. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I think the way we win is just by doing our thing as quickly we as possible. Because swords. Uh, for what is kind of the question? And do we just keep it in and hope that they've got a couple of creatures? Yeah, like if we can force them to go for it really, really quickly, swords can sometimes make it. So if they go for it without an empty deck. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, well, let's do this then. Yeah. We knew exactly what was happening. We could have, like, wastelanded them, but yeah, we yeah. weren't in that place. Uh, ooh. Uh, land, opal, sentinel, go. Um, armor, paladin. I think we have to keep. I'm not happy about it, but I think we have to. I'm just wanted to see. So, land. Opal. Sorry. Then, Sentinel. It's fine, it won't matter here, it's just like, a really good habit to get into. Esper Sentinel! Esper Sentinel means we can draw some cards. Because they're gonna probably it's like... the same as like playing the spring leaf drum before the creature, like. Sorry, is it? Okay. And and one time. That as a song would be amazing. Thank you. That's fine. Uh, so play hammer. Now, uh, mox opal. 
Uh, yeah, I don't think they can kill us next turn, so I think you play both hammers. Because this is all about speed, right? So we yeah, get a yeah, hammer yeah. hammer, next it... turn, yeah, pure it... steel, equip, both kill. Yeah, yeah. Um, I don't think they can kill us all in one go next turn. And no, because you have to... Armor. They need, like, yeah, because they need to paradigm shift, then... Um... Yes. This is one of those things where it's, like, the difference between playing not to lose and playing to win yeah, yeah. is, like, the playing not to lose thing is to just play one hammer and pass. Yeah. But playing to win is going hammer hammer and setting up a win next turn. Okay. If they force it, it sucks. But also, I don't think we're going to win without really going for it. So we draw an extra card. So they're setting up now. We draw an extra card. Yep. That's... If they go petal, petal, we die. It's well, they've happened. got all their, pe their petals are all, all under exile. Yep, so cool. And as is their cat. Uh, oh. How many forces do you see? Right, let me make it bigger. So, so forces, we see one... one negation, two negation, one force of will. Does that mean that hand has three force of wills in it? Oof. One, two, three. No, the force of wills are in the in the. Oh, edge. okay. It's okay, just so fun. they should be dead. They might have pact of negation, but they can't pay for pact of negation. Yeah. So we should be okay. We should be able to kill them. Let's have a look. Okay. Uh, you go Onophopter, then Pure Steel Paladin, then kill them. Look at our sons. Days. Okay. I mean, we couldn't play around days. Okay, we can wasteland them. Uh, how many? Uh, can I just double? Let me just double check something. Back there. How many caverns? Yeah. They've got one cavern. Yeah, they've got one cavern. It looks like. Yeah. Could wasteland them. I mean, if they can't kill us next turn, they deck out, so... Okay. Well... <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! Sometimes they play around the thing that we don't have, and then we have it. Then we're like, we're dead. Okay, we're on the draw list, Sarah, now. <sighs> yeah, which is harder. Yeah. Um, I don't think we change how we board. No. I think... I think we play the exact same way. Yeah, yeah. These amount of times going to do God's work. Okay. That was silly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's that's the thing, though, right? Like, we played to outdraw. We can't kick this hand. It's awful. Yeah, it doesn't kill nearly fast enough and doesn't have interaction. <laughs> This hand is quick enough. This hand's very quick. What do you want to put back, Sarah? March? Is it March? Uh, okay, so turn one mom? we go... No, turn one we need mom. Because okay. uh, we need a creature, right? So it's like turn one, then mom. Turn two, aid, go. Yeah, um, yeah I guess it's March. Okay. Do you want? Oh, we have. Yeah, we have to play mum. Yeah. Unless we draw yeah, an ornithopter. If we draw an ornithopter, maybe we change our mind. But they keep. They also kept. Kept some. Okay. Mox or puzzle control. Okay, so you want to sequence uh, ancient and opal. Mother of runes. Mother of runes! Okay. There we've got a turn. Mm -hmm. I'm so terrified. Yeah, that's fine. I want a mana type, people! Oh! Mmm! Thorinfield? Okay, this is fine. If you're just island cycling, I can deal with that. Basic island. Amazing.
Preordained. Okay. All fine. Okay, if you're not comboing us this turn, that feels a lot better. Yeah, they play the basic land they had. Yep, okay, so we know about the, okay, so we know all the cards. Uh they bottom both of preordain. Okay. That's a good thing to it's know. It's a very good thing to know. So we Oh, they're playing another preordain. Amazing. Sure. Why did you why did you not do both in one go? Sure. Cast... Maybe they thought they didn't want to, and then they were like, no, ah, I should. Sorry, I need to find my cards. Yeah, that kind of... I've been there. Bottom both, jeez, they've looked at four cards, and they're like, none of these are... none of these kill my bond. Okay. Okay, uh, planes. Aid. Oh, uh, off Ancient Den. Yeah, yeah. Aid. And then you play a hammer. Even if they do, you still play Hammer. It turns on Mox Opal, and then we have Paladin next turn. Force Pitch Nasty. Okay, that's fine. Let it happen. Okay, Wait. now you play Hammer anyway. Okay. And then... You hit them for one. No, maybe not. No, no, I... I just leave it back. Okay, just leave it back. She can protect herself. That's the important part. Bounce spells, probably? Yeah. Maybe they've got a dismember. Four mana. Four lash. You mana type that immediately. Absolutely not. Don't do that. Whatever that is, don't do it. Oh, oh, Sarah. Mm. Mm. Yes, Sarah. All right, hammer off the top one time. <sighs> No, uh, play ancient. In fact, don't play ancient. Dan, just play pure steel paladin and equip, and then hit them. We just need to not be dead next turn. <laughs> They've got so much in their graveyard that the magic fingers probably don't actually kill us next turn. Love how you so call it. Have I love to how be you call it. Flash. I love how you. I love how you're like. It's called magic. I'm like. It's it's Fort Lash convert. You know. Just... No, no, paradigm shift and wizards, right? It's it's magic fingers. Oh, we just did. Uh, maybe. Let's let's have it happen. Does this prevent damage? Prevent the one now. They have to exile. Let's exile the top card of your library. Yeah, so they have to exile like a bunch of cards. And then they're gonna have it next turn. So probably dead. Yep, I mean, play Ancient Dan. Swing. They're gonna exile 11 cards. We have to hope both their Foracles are in those 11 cards, or they don't we just, have we a just, Well, we just hand. did 13. I just have... Yeah, yeah, sorry, 13. So pop out the exile. Step through. Kind of hoping they don't have a Foracle in hand, and they have to get rid of all their Foracles. Can I just... Just have sex. Yep. One foracle. Paradigm shift. Cavern of souls. Two foracles! Two foracles! Yes! Okay, I don't think they have three. No, 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 no. I think two is the... And if, if they have three, so be it. But... I think they just... Double check, but I don't know if they, like... I have lost my screenshot. I don't know where it went. So. Oh my! Don't tell me you have another one. Are you actually kidding? Apparently, some less play four. Which probably makes sense for a deck like this. Oh my yep. god! Okay. okay. Mm. Well, we did as well as we could. I swear to God, that's so frustrating. It's fine. I mean, that's how they beat you. We got really close. If we had drawn a hammer that turn, they die. We didn't, so... We get foot lashed, unfortunately. Deck's a lot of fun. Deck is a lot of fun. But we did face... Um, we did face the combo decks, which is not where you want this to be. 
Uh, I think the yeah, so the Goblin State. I think we were very close. That matchup felt very close. Um, and then we lost to Painter. So yeah, we we hit two like combo decks back to back. Um, and then we hit an aggro deck, and then we beat Delver and what do we play round one? Oh, uh, that was Oops All Spells. Oops All Spells. So yeah, we 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 just hit the combo. The typical leagues is noise. Everyone plays combo in Magic Online. Uh, part of the experience, but deck super sweet. Uh, I would recommend it. Um, it's good. I think it's good in a in a situation right now where it there isn't much artifact and enchantment removal. Um, mm -hmm. so everyone is just trying to either go under, um, sort of the top decks of the format in Delver and like Scaminator. Um, so you can kind of kind of cheese some wins by just doing that because you can again grind uh, against some of the blue decks and I think against the combo decks we showed against oops we can kind of do it and then I think this deck you know decks like this or fairer decks uh, typically struggle against the really fast combo because uh, they can't <laughs> just they don't have blue spells so you can't really do it and yes we got we did get some out of time but there's only so much you can do so deck yeah. super fondo I recommend it to everyone uh if you're into this strategy and if you have it in if you already own this deck in modern uh you don't really need much for it to be built in legacy honestly <laughs> like mox you nope. might already own mox opals um it might be you just... need your opals your ancient dance your caracas yeah. and your white ones yeah. but like that's it <laughs> compared to a lot of legacy decks that's pretty a pretty cheap port yeah all of those cards are like staples in legacy so yeah. if it's you want to play legacy but you want to build into other things over time, you can pick up your Wastelands. Those are going to be good in almost any deck. Mox Opal is always Ancient good. Tomb, Ancient Tomb and Mox Opal are not as expensive as they used to be. I'm not Ancient Tomb, Ancient Den. Yeah, Ancient Dens um, are like super cheap. Also, that um, it we'll see if they if the artifact lands get uh, unbanned into modern potentially. But yeah, Mox Opal, if you already were playing Hammer or Affinity, you probably own Mox Opals, folks. Um, and if you don't, they're... It, really Hammer didn't exist back when Mox Opal was Rest legal. Peace, Mox Opal. But yeah. yeah. Either way, if you're an artifact nerd, then you won't Mox Opal. Exactly. And then I think this is good. So I think with that, let us go to the wide. Thank you so much for hanging out. Me and Sarah had a lot of fun doing the old uh, one two punch with uh, Hammer Time. And next week, we are moving on to the letter I. And Sarah, it's going to be a fun one uh we're <laughs> playing probably one of the uh coolest uh decks of the format uh it doesn't get to see play that much but it has some diehard fans and let us know in the comments what you think that deck is but we're, i'm really looking forward to playing it got a lot of content that me and sarah have been preparing for that so we'll see how it goes if you've got this far please feel free to like share and subscribe you know engage with the algorithmic gods tell us what you think about hammer time and until next time, it is a goodbye from me. It is a goodbye from Sarah. Bye. Bye.